guys didn't see me when I came in? I was the one that screamed at you. Um, well, first of all, I want to just take a moment to thank uh, the Bumpus family uh, at all the different uh, Bumpus Harley locations, the brothers and the, the sisters of ours that have uh, kind of kept this thing afloat and helped us come up with uh, great ideas and ways to continue to make money for this foundation, raise money for this foundation, and, uh, and just like Randy said, affect people's lives in a positive way. Um, they have been uh, more than just partners. They're like family to us now, and uh, I don't know if we have any bumpuses, or bump eye, I call them. <laughs> I don't know if we have any bump eye here, but uh, maybe they'll see the video if not, and I just want to tell them that I love them. Uh, appreciate them and um, they truly are family we're, we're very very fortunate to have them as part of this um, what would I say about the foundation uh, even in the hardest times we've continued to to grow and to find a way to, to come out every year with more money in the bank and uh, more great ideas more wonderful people that are committed to making this work and helping us. Um, this is a day that I know more about than you guys think I do. Because you folks that help us get the word out are also the same people that have helped me feed my family and pay the electric bill for the last 15 years. And it's, it's not something that we take for granted. Um, it's ever-changing. I know we hit you guys with new stuff all the time. Um, I personally think that the direction that we're headed with the concert that Randy just talked about might wind up being uh, a real positive thing. We won't know that until we try it. I mean, if we see a trend this year, you know, we can head more in that direction and, and try to grow that. Uh, but I think in this day and time and in our community that something family oriented is is something positive and i think when people see that we you know we we my family we're crazy about kids and uh, they're not going to be kids for long so if we have an opportunity to affect them somehow in a positive way with this event to me that would be the greatest thing you've ever done uh, outside of just helping uh, people you know with, with cancer for instance and other, other things so, um, the idea sounds great to me. I, I am smart enough to know that you don't know what it's going to be until you try it. And so, uh, we're going to give it a shot. Uh, I love uh, the fact that we're just including local talent and regional talent in our show because, to be perfectly honest with you, and I don't mean this in a pompous way at all, we've spent thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars on entertainers to come down here and generally we see the same faces in the crowd and I'm thinking some of these folks might just be coming to see me <laughs> <laughs> and so we've kind of cut it back every year to see and it keeps suggesting that we might be able to draw about the same crowd so I feel like you take other folks from our region and you include them in that you're going to they're going to bring their people with them. And they're going to bring people faces we haven't seen. And they're, and they're going to appreciate the fact that we're letting these folks have a chance to get on a big stage and perform for their people and people who haven't seen them. So I really think it's a great idea. And I really love what it's going to do for our bottom line. Because typically these days, if you're paying out a ton of money for an act, uh, you're going to find it very difficult to, to make that be a money-making venture.